Good morning, everyone. It's Selena here at Amore Fabrics. I'm just going to show you guys. Usually, I don't do a video on stock that comes in. This is stock that I get weekly. Um, I just got in some more Sari uh, fabrics. And um, I wanted to show you guys how they arrive and then um, show you how I sort through kind of thing. I normally don't do that because it does take time. I do have a log that shows, you know, what I ordered and I need to verify it's the right colors. Um, also, I need to verify if they're in good condition, stains, what have you, before I even get to dig right into it. And then it's the processing of making sure that they don't smell, that they're clean, all that good stuff. But I want to give you a sneak peek here to show you. Um, I'm going to put the camera on the tripod here in a minute. So then I can kind of have you hands-free to show you what they kind of look like and how uh, I work with this. Um, I hope you guys like this. Uh, process and I'm showing you if you are new here again uh, don't forget to like subscribe I like always like thumbs up um, and um, you can kind of see what I do uh, when I do process the sorry fabrics that I have in a shop All right, let me press pause really quick okay here hopefully this angle is better um, it's an absolutely beautiful day today I got all the doors open up in the warehouse and um, I wish I can show you guys. Maybe another video I can show you the garden, everything coming in. It's absolutely beautiful out there. Um, makes me want to go out there and just play in the yard all day, but I can't. <laughs> I have work to do, man. So I'm going to open up. This is red. Obviously, you could tell it's red. Seems like when I get the red sari, I find that it has more beaded pieces than anything else that I get. Um, second, I would say purple would be the second thing. Um, so I'm just going to open up red really quick. I don't know if I'll go through all of it, but I do want to show you the colors I have today. So I need my glasses, so <laughs> we could do this. All right, so usually it comes like this. It's all knotted like this, which is cool because it's saves on bags, right? So they're being very smart on that. I know for me as a business person, anything to save, recycling is good. Look at that. All right, so each one of these are a sorry, sorry uh, scarf. So you can see they come like this. They don't smell bad, thank goodness. Looks like a beautiful one. And I just kind of put it over there. So I separate, usually when I do them, I separate by the designs um, and patterns. Because say, if you do decide to get the, the sorry square packs that I have, I want you to have as much design in it as possible. So I wouldn't cut this one because there's so many gaps. I want you to have as much a sequence in beads as possible. So these guys won't be in that, uh, but look at this one. Oh my, you're going to see all kinds of beads. Look at these, but these are the ones I would probably cut out appliques for you guys. Oh, here again, I'm not in center. It has a bunch of those and look at that beaded one. This would be awesome. <clears throat> I think for Christmas, like a Christmas kit. Um, so I like him. He's pretty. Okay, this one will be in the Sari Square Packs because look how the design's all over. It's a pretty sheer. It's adorable. And look at the dangles at the bottom. All right, this one definitely will be in the Square Packs as well. If you want to know what I'm talking about, Square Packs down below, I'll have the shop. Go under the Fabrics of India tab. You'll see all the products we have. That's a square. Look at this one. Look at that. I don't know if you guys can see that. Look at all the beads. It's just gorgeous. Oh, look at this. Now, I know next week, because I what I do is I cut off all this, this different uh, trim. And what I do is I've been keeping it. And it's like about a yard or so each one. But look at all those dangles and trims. My gosh. And I'll be, I'll be listing them next week. So if you're interested and you want me to update you when I do that, message below. I'll put you on the log. Yes, it's just endless goodies. Obviously, you can see I'm already separating what goes where. I already know in my head what goes where. That goes there. Of course, this would be going. Now, those who don't know, I do have in the shop by the color applique packs where um, I have 25 appliques like this. Is all I do is I cut those out, these appliques. And it's I think it's like uh, 25 for $20. And they're pretty good large sizes. It's rather cheap. I don't think people realize I have it, but I have them in every color and every pack. Uh, and they're nice, large, like least size of your hand, five inch or larger appliques. Um, so check that out. That's there. 
absolutely beautiful, right? I guess I can move on to blue. Press pause. I know what I'm doing here. I just want to show you. But look at there. And look at all these pretty, pretty appliques. All right, guys. I'm press pause and do another color for you guys. Okay, we can do this. Here's blue. I hope you guys are enjoying this. I normally don't <laughs> do this because it's really it's a it's a job. And normally when I have to do this, I gotta know what I'm looking at. Which after the video. I count it all, I go through it all, um, and I'll, I'll sort through it to see what's what. I just wanted to give you guys an idea, whoo, she really nodded this one, um, what I get when I get it in the mail. Um, geez Louise, but hey, at least it's together. <clears throat> so, okay, I could do this. One more knot. <laughs> I should press pause for this. Funny, at least you can get a little laugh. Watch the Lena suffer looking at a Okay, it looks like this is a mixture. I wonder if I could do it this way. Kind of. It's going to fall all down this table. Let's try. Looks like she did added some purples in with it. Um, as you guys notice in the shop, I do have the light blue, sorry. Um, but I just introduced the dark blues, which dark blue is very hard to find. Also, what's hard to find is the whites and ivories, which I'm going to put over here. Um, as you can see, the bundle's really small. It's hard to get it. So when I have it in the shop, it's limited supply. I don't have a lot. It's hard uh, to get those colors in India. I'm not sure why. Um, they guess go for the bolder colors, obviously. But the white ivories, I have those. Another color that's really hard to get is black. And see the bundle's really small. So like I said, when I get it, it's a limited supply. So um, check it out and hopefully you can get some. Uh, when they're out, they're out until I can finally, the next following week, hopefully get more. Um, I keep the price the same, even though maybe I should raise the price because it's hard to get. But um, I'm not. I'll keep the price the same. Because when it comes in, it comes in, right? I want to give you guys a good deal. All right. So blue. Look at the beautiful blues. Those blue lovers. You can see all the beautiful things I get. Here's some dark. I'm really interested in the dark. See? And it's just okay. Just okay. See, I'm what I mean. Uh, it's okay. But that's a pretty one. So I'm gonna separate that really quick. Get those darks. They're just okay. But the packs I have in the shop are gorgeous. That are already done. What you see in the shop um, when you go to the shop listing for the dark blues, what you see is exactly what you're gonna get um, in the new packs because it's a new listing. Um, must be good for the dark blues as well. Okay, but it looks like I got some cool purples in here. I need to separate that because when I do the count, see what I mean when I say purple seem to have some really pe uh, beaded. Purple's the same thing. It's hard to find good solid prints. Usually when I get the purples, I get the pretty beaded. Put purple over there. There's another, oh, it looks beautiful. I know I have a customer who has a wedding coming up and this is a color she's looking for and it's a hard color to find and I have the least one. So I can go ahead and message her. That's beautiful. Yes. I have this uh, lady in New York. Oh, here's the dark blue. Sweet. I can at least show her these prints. Maybe she might like these too, but I don't think they're her colors. But um, she has like this certain colors from fuchsia to orange. And, and she's having this huge wedding in New York. And uh, she's all excited. And so I've been doing custom orders for her. Oh, I love this purple. That's pretty. That's really pretty. Look how elegant that is. Soft. Another purple. All right, let's separate purple. Hope I'm not rambling too much. But okay, so it's, this is just pack number two. And whew, I usually, every uh, week I get 300 um, saris that I go through. And then uh, Kantha, I get about 100 Kantha quilts. So I have to sort through those on top of not only doing orders, listings, customers, uh, you know, messages, all those kind of things. But, um, I did hire, uh, two workers. One is consistent. Um, and, uh, she helps part time. She's in school right now. Her name's Lexi. And, um, so I guess I could possibly, that's not dark enough. Put it dark blue. All right. I'm going to go to the next color to show you guys. Um, I'll probably go to pinks. Everyone loves those pinks. All right. Let me go on to the pinks. It's really funny if you guys can see this my tripod is like on an angle <laughs> I know that if I hit it just once this thing's gonna fall right over so if it does 
least we'll see me just tipped sideways kind of thing. But I wanted to show you guys this one. Look at this. Look at that trim. Isn't that gorgeous? And look at all these cute appliques they have in it. Isn't that pretty? All the way through it. So that'll be an applique pile. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, pink. As you can say, it's okay in size. Pink is hard to find as well, but not as hard. I just know when I get a small order like this, that next week's order, I request a larger and hopefully they'll have it. Um, so it's almost like a balancing act because I want to keep these items stocked for you guys. But um, it's just, I have to constantly check stocks, check conditions. I don't have to go over the whole thing with you again, but uh, you've seen that pretty. Yeah, so this is a weekly thing. It's like a, it's fun. I feel so blessed that I can be home doing this. Pretty, pretty pinks. Look at this one. Oh my gosh, look at these appliques. So pretty, not pretty. Endless, right, applique. So here's some pinks. We got a good mixture of light pale to periwinkle to like a fuchsia. There's another applique, I had to separate that. You know, after a while, I get used to the patterns. I've seen these patterns so many times. I know them by heart. <laughs> Here's an applique one that um, I have to uh, see there's beads. Look at some appliques. There's another, another applique. And that pretty, look at the two-tone, like a darker to the lighter. All right, guys, you can kind of see. Oh, look at that. I have to show you. Yeah, just absolutely stunning. Maybe I should just do what you see is what you get applique packs now. If you guys like that, I'll do that because the applique packs I have in the shop, um, it's just random. So it's whatever I cut that time. So I don't really show you what you see is what you get. But if you guys like, um, comment down below what you think. If I should start doing applique packs by color, that what you see is actually what you get. Maybe you guys might like that or notice it more. Uh, but look at those pieces. Even the tiny little guys are cute. Look how tiny. Those will definitely go into the snippet pack. So when I cut these up, that's considered a snippet for me. And um, if you guys like the snippet packs, um, that's those kind of things is what goes in there. So I do a lot of work, guys. <laughs> it takes a lot. I got to cut and measure and it's a big job. But it is fun to me. I just blare my music and I go for it. All right, let's go to a different color, guys. How about peach? Peach is hard to find and I have a bunch of it this time. So... Hang on one second. Okay, here's Peach on a balancing act here. We could do this. All right, thankfully we have only one knot. Maybe I should unknot this before I actually press play so it doesn't take too much time. But I'm not perfect, right? All right, okay, it looks like this is a mixture. So it looks like this is, because um, I did request browns. Brown packs, like dark brown packs, are in the shop. They're new as well. Brown is another thing it's hard to find. Uh, it's it's quite a job trying to figure out and separating colors. There we go. Yep. So this looks like we have a lot of nice browns in here as well. Um, so the brown packs are like a chocolate and like a coffee dye color packs so in the shop. He would go more towards the peachy. Well, here we go. Dark browns. That's what I mean. That's what I want. That one, the brown packs. Absolutely gorgeous. Right? For those who like browns. Uh, this would be like, I don't know if that'd be in the brown, so I'm going to put that aside. This one is almost like a, a burgundy-ish brown. Maybe might make it in there. I don't know. It looks more towards the reds to me. We'll see. This is the orangey colors. I have an orange pack, but this wouldn't be in the orange pack. This would be in, I have, it's called a orangey brown pack because it's like a rustic orange. Um, I'd rather have bright oranges in the orange packs. Um, that would be in difference. So again, as you guys can see, I have to separate colors because, you know, when someone's working on their project and they're like, man, those oranges are not the oranges I expected. Um, I want to make sure I'm doing it right. This looks more yellow to me. That's pretty. Look how elegant that is. It seems like a canary yellowish. Got some tones of brown though. I don't know. I got to, I try to match it to the listing as much as possible. Your guys' happiness is my, my happiness. This would be the orangey-ish browns color. This looks like more red to me. This pile is going to be a hard pile for me because it's like trying to determine the color pack. Um, uh, maybe towards the browns or reds. I don't know. 
So this is going to be a difficult pack because it's different. Oh, wow. Look at the dangles on him. Could be a dangler over there. Um, okay. This one's going to be a difficult one. I have work to do. <laughs> Let me go to the next pack. Let's see. We got yellows. So this wasn't the peach pack. I'm going to go with the peach pack right now. I think it's peach because I did request peach. It's, hmm, I do my best to be patient because uh, they do the best they can to fill my requests. So let's go ahead and see what the peach looks like. Okay. Well, it looks more orangey than peach to me. And I have this feeling that this isn't 300 uh, scarves. Um, I, I bought 300. I have this feeling. So I know the size of bundles what they should be like because this should be 50 and this is not 50. Um, so I'm trying, I hope I'm, I don't want to be upset. It's like, that's the part of what I do on the side. I have to talk to other vendors and that's the hard part I would say of what I do because, uh, they don't always do what you say. And then you have to go back and forth and back and forth. And I'll say, dear friend, I will send it next time. And then you're like, no, I bought it this time. And, uh, I'm not going to complain. Um, these are just okay. I'm not a huge fan. Yeah, they don't, they look more on the cheap end. Um, so I'm going to have to message them. Yeah, I just, that's just not for me. Um, I request a certain type. I pay for a certain type. I should get it. Um, so that's the hard part of business because then I have to be, get my big girl panties on. Yeah, like this is a no, no, um, no, 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 no. <laughs> All right, we got one, one pretty peach. Not cool. Just one. Yeah, this is a no, um, a no, no. <laughs> I'm picky and that to me I don't know about you guys I know it's pretty but that is not what I sell this is not what I ask for um, it's not beaded it is not sequins it's not pretty all right you guys get to see the er part of me and it's mad that's orange it's not peach all right we got a peach that's pretty these are two pretty peaches that's not too bad together all right I found a third peach three out of 50 so far not looking good um, this is orange, not peach. Okay, so I will not be upset. It's still pretty, right? Here's peach. It's a pretty, pretty peach. This is a peachy pink. I'll put in the peaches. It's pretty. It's another peach. And it looks like we got an orange. This is pretty, but it's not my peach. This is pink, not peach. And there's peach. All right, you guys, I'm not happy with peach. You can see. Now you get to see. Selena, not happy. That's orange. Okay. I'm going to pause this to go to the next thing and deal with this later. <laughs> right. Okay. It looks like this is the purples I have. I'm going to have to push this down some for you guys. And I'll show you some of these. I'm going to go kind of a little bit faster because uh, I want to deal with this peach thing. And this peach is not the only thing. I know I don't have enough product. Um, plus they shorted me uh, 41 of them on my last order. I don't see them on here on this 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 order um, 41 uh, Sorry's missing is a huge thing. So a little upset. Trying to be positive here. So yeah, you can see some purples All right, so that's the purple pile and uh, Let's go ahead and I'll put this on the rack and keep the thing playing and go to yellow And then I'm gonna show you guys the rack at the end um, where I put it right on the rack and then I have to sort through it later. All right, yellows, as you guys can see here. Pretty, pretty yellows, not bad. That's more orangey to me than yellow. Some pretty, pretty yellow. It looks kind of greenish to me. Green greens, yellow. That looks green, like a green yellow. Yeah, it's just okay. Like that's a no-no, I don't do that. Not bad. Just okay. It's orange. Okay, for being a yellow pile, it's a whole lot of not yellow. Okay, this is pretty. Not pretty. Now that's a yes for sure. Yeah. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. So you're not so happy. <laughs> oh, it's okay. Could be worse, right? Um, other things could be worse than mine. All right, put that on the rack. Got it falling down. All right, yellow. 
right? And then that's green, which does not look like 50. Now these bundles are supposed to be 50 of each. Um, and I don't look like it's, it doesn't look like it's 50. That looks yellow. That is totally brown. This is a green pile. It doesn't look green. Oh Lord. All right. That's pretty. Definitely out the case. That looks yellow. More green. You got some pretty beaded. You guys can see here other greens in there as well. That's the green pile. I have to count that here in a little bit. All right. And then I think I have just this black and white one. And that's all I have. Woo! See? I almost lost you guys. So it looks like I might be missing... Um, uh, it looks like I might be missing uh, either another box supposed to be coming or something. Um, sorry, guys. My tripod thing decides to do its own thing. Today is not my day, but we'll do our best. Oh, Lord have mercy. All right, I think we got it. All right, so it looks like we have white and black. And then I'm going to let you guys go because then I'm going to have to write this person after I count each item. Because who knows, I might be wrong. But I, I do know for sure my colors are not right on some things. But um, maybe my count I might be on. Um, but I, I don't know. I'm pretty good at remembering this. So I do this every week. Here's some white ivories. Not bad. Very pretty. I'm happy. Pretty. So I do have the white ivory packs in the shop as well, guys. Check that out. Yep, they're pretty. I'm liking the white ivories. Hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. Yep, white ivories, not too bad, not too bad. Okay, let me see if I can get to this black and then I'll show you guys the rack, how it kind of looks. Well, it's a mess right now because I'm kind of throwing it on there because I'm a little on the fussy side right now. That or any more coffee. <laughs> oh Lord, um, it'll work out guys, right? All right, black is not too bad. Ooh, I see a really pretty, pretty, pretty beaded one. Look at that. That makes me happy. That's a yes. Yes, yes, yes. All right, let's see. We got some brown and black in there. All right, not bad. All right, not so bad, guys. Oh, I'm going too fast. Okay. Let me press pause and I'll show you guys the rack really quick. Okay, so this is just the rack for the new stuff I just got in today. So I just set it on the rack to show you guys what it looks like. Um, right here, I have some of the leftover colors I gotta go through. So this is today's, um, I need to count them, I need to go through them, um, and then I need to message this vendor um, on the good, the bad, and the ugly. So <laughs> have a good one. I'm gonna enjoy the fresh outdoors and uh, try to stay positive without getting too mad about um, <laughs> that. Because um, there's more important things to do today than to get all fussy about this. But I do like getting what I pay for. So, and I work really hard for this. So, well, we can do this. Maybe I should just take my bike out for a ride and then come back to, uh, <laughs> to really get through this. So, all right, guys, you guys have a blessed day. Thank you for taking the time to see work a sweat and get this stuff open to show you what like one order that comes in what it looks like all right guys have a blessed day